Hello, my beautiful spicy hot Cheetos. How are you guys? It has been a really long time since I've uploaded anything to my YouTube. And a really long time for me is like a couple months because that's too long to be on a hiatus for me. And I'm really picky and I'm really strict about my upload and all that stuff. So I'm really sorry I've been gone for so long, but I'm back and I'm better than ever. I thought for my comeback video, what better to do something than hot Cheeto wise? I'll tell you the story. So, I was going grocery shopping with a friend of mine. We were browsing around the store looking for just something to eat for dinner or whatever. And then I came across a new flavor of hot Cheetos. Now, if you don't know me, you will know I have an addiction to hot Cheetos. And it doesn't matter what flavor, it can be like the regular, typical, blah, hot Cheeto, it can be hot Cheetos con limon, um, it can be any type of hot Cheetos. I just, I adore it. I can eat it with pickles, I can eat it with cheese, I can eat it with uh, trechas, I can eat it with chamoy, I can eat it with bread. I can eat it with basically anything and everything and I love it. I came across this amazing bag of hot Cheeto flaming hot Chipotle Ranch and I thought we would taste it on camera together. It's brand spanking new, just rolled out the market. I'm so excited to try it and I wanted to do a taste test review like with you guys. I haven't opened this bag. I bought it like a week ago and I haven't been able to open it until today and I'm gonna open it and we're gonna eat it together. And the cool thing about it is I just read, look for a freaking interesting hot and cheesy Cheeto shape. Because if we look for one and we find a crazy interesting shape, we can win 150k, y'all. So let's crack this bag open! Alright. This is the first. I need to like ASMR this bag. Okay, smell test. You gotta smell it before you do anything else. Oh my god, you guys. I'm not even gonna smell it, but look at that. Oh, that, there's no like contrast or anything. Like that is what it looks like. That's crazy. Okay, okay. All right. No, we need a big juicy one for our first. Oh yes, that is what I am talking about right here. Look at that. To get that crunch in there um i mean like it's okay oh whoa woo, woo, woo. oh man okay it hits you in the punch a couple of seconds later i haven't even been inspecting it before putting it in my mouth to see if they got cool shapes i could have just eaten arnold schwarzenegger or pokeball well let me talk about the taste first for those of you who have ever been to a flea market whichever one you want when you go and you eat there, because typically when you go to a flea market, you want to spend all day there. You want to get the best bang for your buck, you know what I mean? So you spend all day there and you get hungry. So you want some tacos or something that they sell there. This kind of tastes like those tacos. And that's the best description in which I can, that's this is as good as I can probably get to. They got like a sort of like Taco Bell flavor. Ah, right. let's start looking for shapes. What do you think? This could be like Maui's hook. Kind of looks like that side by side comparison. No? Uh huh. And like, it says there's chipotle ranch in it. I can totally taste the chipotle because it's got like that very peppery, earthy smell. And you like breathe it out. So that's the chipotle. But I don't taste the ranch at all because ranch is like very creamy and very like, I don't know. It's got like a very like uh, tangy almost flavor. I don't taste that in this at all. So I don't know what they're talking about when they say chipotle ranch. It's more like chipotle with milk. Because it kind of does have like a creamy flavor a little, but not nearly to the extent of what they're saying ranch. Because ranch got that, I mean like you know when you have a ranch chip, like you bite that and you're like, whoa, that's ranch. This doesn't have that same kind of flavor. But I don't see any really interesting shapes, just big Cheetos, which if I was using the typical of Cheeto, that would be awesome, but unfortunately, Hot Cheeto Company 
This is probably not your best. Still tasty. I'm still supportive of everything that you do hot Cheeto wise. But maybe next time you should do like hot Cheeto buffalo wing sauce or something. But I think you need like a buffalo wing hot Cheeto. Like, yes, please. I will definitely be on board with that one. And I will eat it in a second. Okay. Well, that was a fail. Kind of. So also included in this video is a nice little extra bonus that um, I didn't really even mention that I was going to do, but I was going to do it anyway. So I am an influencer, 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 influencer tester, and they send me products and I can test them. So they sent me this big old box full of goodies that I thought we would open together. All so, so let's open it, shall we? Gotta rip off that tag. They're very sweet with their bubble wrap. Ooh! Uh, so they have red hot. This is what you need, uh, hot Cheetos. Maybe like a red hot hot Cheeto. Maybe they already have that. But we should try this on our hot Cheeto. Maybe it'll like enhance our hot Cheeto experience. Um, so we got lotion, which is cool. Toothpaste, which is perfect because I literally just ran out. And face wipes. Hair wipes. Woo woo! I don't know what this is. That's really cool. I'm excited. I'm excited to use those. If you want to be an influencer, go to their website and sign up and see if you qualify. You can get free stuff too. Well, it's like free. All right, so let's try this. We got our hot Cheeto with Chipotle Ranch. Put some Red Hot Franks in here. Freaking stellar that they sent me this while I was doing a review for this. Like that's perfect. Oh. Smells so good. Alright, let's dump it on one chip first. Got one dip in there. Oh my god, that made it so much better. That like intensified every flavor in this Chipotle Ranch bag. I just discovered something. Ew, my spit. Should I just dump the whole thing? Oh my gosh, y'all, I just discovered something awesome. Dude, if we put pickle juice in here. Oh my god, I'm putting pickle juice in here. I always carry pickle juice in my fridge because you never know when you're gonna need it and I'm so glad I kept it because there's like maybe two pickles in here. Oh! Oh my gosh, I think I just created their new thing. Hire me for your next sponsored thingy thing. Oh, backwards. Hire me for your next sponsored thingy thing of what flavor should we make next? Frank's Red Hot Flamin' Hot Cheetos with pickle juice and pickles. You're welcome. Million dollar idea. Oh, that's a good one, that's a good one. And let's like mix it in with a pickle. Look at that, look at it, it's like super wet. Oh my God, that is so good. Let's shake it. I might have just ruined this bag, but yeah. Oh my God, that improved the flavor like, like crazy. So Hot Cheeto, for realsies, next time, Hire me. I don't know who you got working the hot cheeto machine back there, but they don't. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I should be a professional and put this down while I'm doing an outro, but it ain't gonna happen. This is hot cheeto time. If you like this video, please do me a favor and literally like this video by clicking on that button. Comment if you have tried these already and if you liked them or not and if you made any improvements to them. And subscribe to this channel for more fun things like this. I should be continuing my Lion Tail series um, season two, hopefully sometime really, really soon. I'll be doing more taste tests, things like this, and other fun projects. So please subscribe! And if not, it's okay, I still love you. Thank you, my pretty little fuzzy sunshine biscuits. I'll see you guys in the video after this one. Bye!